Hey everybody, and welcome to part 3 of Crash Bandicoot Wrath of Cortex. This video is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. In the last episode, we finished off uh, the Hub World 1. And in this video, we'll be doing Rumble in the Rocks, seeing what this is all about. What kind of boss battle awaits us? I think there's like a little cutscene here too. Well, looks like the Bandicoot's been busy collecting crystals. I warned you, Bandicoot. Finally. I get to wrap my fingers around your puny orange neck. Now, is that the guy who plays the principal on uh, American Dad? I don't know. Well, this doesn't look too bad. Oh, he turns into a ball and 100%... Oh, no, we're in a ball. Really? What do I have to do? Do I have to hit the rocks? I can't remember, I haven't played this game in forever. Come on, move. Come on, crash. Okay. Now, where's the other one? Oh, okay, wait a minute. Oh, okay, wait, wait, wait. I think I damaged him with the rocks. Where's the rocks? Where's the rocks? There you are, rock. There we go. So I have to hit all the rocks. And it does some damage to him. Ooh, ooh. That's pretty weird. So what, three hits and he's down? I bet you now there's like three rocks and then the final thumb's four rocks. Yep. How'd I know? Typical game concept. I think if he hits them, they turn back into neutral rocks. And if he hits them, they turn into the rocks that can damage you. How I hit that rock. Oh wow, that was easy. Let's do some more damage to what is his name? Crunch? I think his name is Crunch. Ooh. This is an extremely easy first boss. The controls are kind of weird. And it's very rare they actually get to fight the boss as Crash, like, you know, as himself running around. Because the elementals have weird powers. He makes him stone, so apparently rocks are the way to beat him. And oh, frick, he neutralized that rock again. This is what can be a pain, is when he neutralizes things. You know, let's keep him away from him, and he just neutralized the rock again. If you can keep him away from the rocks, the better. And ow! Stop neutralizing my rocks! Because it takes a while for his to go off. Okay, we got two more. I wish if your rocks hit each other, they would, uh, you know, activate. Instead of... Oh, come back here. We have one rock left. Yeah, we should have defeated him right here. Eat that, boss. Ow. Hit my controller. Do we do it? Yay, and what's that? Double jump? Sneak shoes. To sneak along suspended nitro crates, hold the Z button while moving. Oh yeah, that was the, pretty much the only new concept here. And it sucks. It's good, but at the same time, it sucks. Because it's not that creative. It's not that new, and it's kind of pointless in most cases. Once you get double jump, you can just dump, double jump over most things. So yeah, nice, we did it. And oh, Cortex. back again, eh? When are you and that super weapon of yours going to put an end to that interfering bandicoot? You are beginning to test my patience. Uh, uh, I'm working on a Duka Uka. Listen, Crash, you may have outsmarted Rocco, but there are three more elemental masks where he came from. And just as luck would have it, they are all significantly more powerful. Ha! I have no doubt that the water elemental, Wawa, will make sure you never see the light of day. Yeah, the water boy and I are gonna take you out. Ooh, I'm gonna rip you limb from limb. Wawa? Seriously, his name is Wawa? You could have came up with a better name, Wawa. Let's see, we have Jungle Rumble. We have Seashell Shenanigans. Bonsai... Really? Bonsai Bonsai? That Sinking Feeling. And H2O No. Most of them are like, vehicle levels. This kind of bumps me up, but let's do Jungle Rumble, which I think is a Jeep level. Which is another new concept in this game. Crash Bandicoot, you've got some nerve setting foot into my domain without an invitation. 
Don't talk back to me! I'll fix that attitude problem of yours! Okay, so he's some kind of army sergeant elemental? That's kind of insane. You're a water dude, why are you so freaking, you know, army dude delicious? You'd think the rock guy would be, not like, Hey dude, I'm gonna smash you a new one. This guy actually means business. I think this boss too is also the cool looking one. There's a wind one, and then there's, I forget the other one. Oh, there's 150 boxes. What's new? And there's what looks like to be some little weird girl monkey-like creature, but I have no clue what it is, and oh, this box is blinking, so we gotta get it before it, you know, goes off. Let's get those. Eh, yeah, collect these while I'm waiting. Oh, hey, look, you guys are throwing spears. How very feminine. Hey, let's try that sneak. Hmm, pretty good. Because, you know, if you get too close to these, they blow up. This allows you to get, like, right next to them. Even though, most of them, most of the time you can. It's nothing new. And really? You put that there for nothing? Huh, and what happened to her? Oh, yeah, we lost when we died. Never mind. Uh, 2250. And, hey, there he is. Oh, more of them. At least they don't turn around. Okay, now I think for this one... Yeah, you can't get back up this one, remember that. Another thing is, you have to get this up here like that. Now, I think you can break all these ones if I'm not mistaken. Okay, no, not all of them. Some of them are regular metal blocks. Should be getting to the concept of the level here pretty quick. I think it's just up around this river bend, actually. Oh, we get another life here, too. Yeah, there we go. 37. And maybe we'll get to 69 lives. I don't care about that, it's just gonna be a stupid thing anyway. What's over? Really? I don't, I don't know what this is, but let's uh, get it. 40? Not bad. How many will we have? 145 and 150, not bad. Really? That can turn into a nitro. There it is, there's the Jeep. Okay, now if we mess up, we have that own. Oh, hey, bonus level 2. Nice. Hopefully there's not too many boxes on the cheap part. Let's say the music here is, is okay. Not, not nothing, you know, fancy for a video game. But what can you expect? It's a crash game. They generally use music a lot. Old music a lot. Like the bonus music is still the same. A little bit different of a uh, um of a mix though. And, well, I at least want to get that light before that one blows up. I don't know if it actually hit it. Hit those. Let's wait for them to blow up because you never know if it's gonna get them or not. It can be really glitchy like that. Oh no no no! This is what the tippy toe is for. It's to walk along them. I forgot about that. I thought it was like meant for you know actually. Now the tip is to hit the top one. Then you'll have that extra bounce at the end to get this block. See, like that. Pretty cool, eh? There's a lot of boxes here. 49 for bonus level. Now. Oh no, I screwed up. I have to. I have to kill myself. I'm sorry. Goodbye. I. I didn't mean to. But I think you have to slide jump to get up there something like that and you don't want to blow up that TNT because then you can't get the box that's above it. And I really wish I didn't have to go through every womp of fruit when we do that. Can't wait to get tornado spin because then you can double jump in tornado spin and you can get along uh, big distances. When I was young I was like four or five playing this game. I did not know that. But now I do so it's like crash is a lot easier than it was but at the same time it's still difficult. So anyways, let's try this again. So we need to hop on that one, do that. Let's get that life again. Whoa, we'll get away from that. We got some extra Wampa fruit this time. Do this. Okay, good. We didn't have to wait for it after all. And careful, the Z button is probably the worst button on the GameCube controller. So, you, you know, you always gotta be careful. So, let's hit the top one. I guess I know this. I'm kinda just repeating myself now, because... 
I have nothing to talk about while doing this bonus. So what do you guys think of this channel so far? Um, I have no problem will never, you know, be that big due to the fact that, um, wait, now how do I do this? Um, do I, do, I, no, I can't do it like that. How do I do that? Um, Can I slide underneath? I'm assuming I'll have to slide underneath that. I, see what I mean by stupid box placement? That's one of them. So my sore throat, I'm recording all three of these last videos in the same day. Uh, my throat doesn't seem, seem to be too bad. My tongue's slightly swollen because, you know, I get like that when I get a sore throat. And other than that, maybe some slight slurring, I, I'm pretty good. And I'm really thirsty though, too, so that doesn't help. And oh, I actually got all the boxes that time without, you know, triggering the TNT. Pretty good. Okay, now this part is just time consuming. We're at like the 11 minute mark, man, and we were only on the second level. Wait, no, first. The, f we did the boss, I forgot. Okay, now let's hit the top one. Get the slice again. Well, actually, we need to get the box in general. Now, here's the stupid placement. Okay, now if I'm not mistaken... Oh yeah, we have to slide! And we're still missing boxes, I hope they're not hard to get. Oh, thank god. You guys are easy to get. One, two, three, four, five. Where's the last one? Oh, I thought I wasn't gonna make that for a second and be like, Oh man, all that work for nothing. Yeah, we get lots of lives, so we make the thing. We didn't even die. We're not even making up any lives. I won't get two lives from the Wampa Fruit, but, you know, whatever. Oh, yeah, it's like a chase level. Oh, wait, it is a chase level. Never mind. It's a chase level. But with rhinos. I think I'm gonna die, because for some reason, I got really far back. Okay, it's generally not too hard if you just follow like the ramps and stuff and only oh, you guys actually got that for me. And oh hey look, the rhinos left. Leaving me in the dust. Leaving me in the Wait, no, I left them in the dust. Oh no, they cut back up. Follow the Wampa fruit. Okay, we should almost be done. There's a lot of nitro around here too. I think this part is just pretty much dodging while the boxes are pretty much generic spots. Okay, yeah, now that should be the end of the level. Yeah, and there's the nitro switch and the two boxes, so yeah, and there's the crystal, nice. I think I'll do one more level for this video, and please get the gem. Yeah! We haven't had to go back to a level yet. Oh. Another bonus level. It's the bonus levels that are getting me, not the levels themselves. Except for Bamboozled, I had a few problems with that one. Just because of my stupidity. I rolled off a cliff a couple of times. That was fun. Anyways, uh, we have Seashell Shenanigans, which I think is an underwater level. I didn't. I couldn't remember that they brought these back. I wonder if we get a little blabbering too. No. If it says loading, uh, we don't get a talking to. If it doesn't say loading, obviously it's gonna be a cutscene because you know it pops up on the screen. Self-explanatory, really. And how are the controls? Exact the same. And, hmm, music. Pretty catchy underwater music. The wall is kind of weird though. 99 boxes. What the heck is that? Can I kill it? Weird. Not sharks in this one. Get those weird things. And what the frick are they? Oh, I didn't get the live. Oh, mine. I should really double check my surroundings for mines in the air. Yeah, they added a few new concepts to the water ones, and these guys are actually underwater now. Um, there's no secret gem here, though, or like, you know, second gem, or really secret gem. Really? I got hit by the diver who didn't even do anything. 
there's down the mines or something, but not those guys. You know, what's down here exactly? The jellyfish in the background creep me out. It's like they're just gonna kill me. Hey, I'm gonna call you Chompo, and why do I have a feeling that over by the... Um... That touched the tip of my foot. That seriously would kill me? Oh, at least I'm about to get another life here to make up for. You generally make up for your lives really fast in this game. So it's not too bad. Stay away from the fish. Since I guess... Really? There's nothing over here. There's nothing around... Finally, Aku Aku. We're not losing you to this stupid diver, and his core does hurt you, so be careful on that note. Whoa! I gotta go up a little bit so I can see those guys. Whoa! Big fish! And I didn't spin in time. These in the other Crash game, the water levels are the easy ones for me. There's like no boxes. Where are they all? Where are. Oh god, this. Uh, mine again. Sometimes they destroy boxes for you! I did not see that coming until it was too late. Yeah, this will definitely be the last level of this video if I keep messing up like this. They're not even like, you know, normal parts to mess up on. I'm messing up on the easy parts. Can I even kill you guys? Okay, I can. Aku Aku, I need you again. This time I'm not losing you to a, what, a fish? Mine. I'm not losing you to him again. Okay, I see that mine there. And I swam into it somehow. Okay, anyways. Okay, do you see any mines? They're oh god, they really made these water levels difficult in this game. At least you could put one in the first world. I don't know if I really want to get that, but oh, I got it anyway. There should be a checkpoint in here anyway, too. Saying anyway is a lot. I'm just scared there's going to be enemies in here. How far does this level go down before we get to a checkpoint? Anything over here? No. Oh god, those guys move. You know, in vertical and horizontal and diagonal and every direction possible. Checkpoint! Remember, for TNT, you have to get the TNT, otherwise, you know, you'll miss out on them. And all you have to do is touch them with your news. How many boxes do we have? Only 35 and 99. Hopefully a lot of them are nitro. Okay, anything down here? Oh! Did anyone else see that? Because uh, I sure didn't. And you have to touch the top with your nose. Okay, Crash, let's get away from that fish, just creeps me out. Mm, I need an Aku Aku. Really badly. Oh, you can't see- oh, I guess if you go up you can see it. But you can't see it if you're going down, that's funny. Oh, wait a minute. You go to the side, you don't even go- Wait, what the heck is this? Oh, really? So now I get a weapon? They added subs into this game, instead of those, uh, whatever they're called in the other game. I'm gonna let the mine get out of my way before I continue on. Okay, nothing down there, I didn't think there would be that just be a terrible placement. But you never know, GameCube and PlayStation 2 are notorious for difficult games, as well as easy games. I'm kind of not looking forward to doing Mega Man because I'm not very good at the original Mega Man. At the same time, it is a good game, I'm not going to lie. I'm pretty good concept of being in what, an 87 game. Wow, I'm getting stuff from you. Know, just, I actually don't want to keep firing like that, I might do something stupid. Well, let's have Aku Aku if I run into a mine. Like that. Or like that. But I didn't actually get hit, so that's funny. Okay, jellyfish, get out of the way. Um, okay, nothing else. 43 boxes. I don't know, this just doesn't seem a very fair level. Oh yeah, I forgot B to drop bombs. 
That's a bad move on my part. And there's definitely something over there. I'm gonna get this before I go over here. So I think if we die, we lose our submarine and thingy. I don't want that to happen. Once again, nothing. So what our underwater levels are so long. Well, uh, at least you can't complain about this game. Oh yeah, those guys shoot you. Oh, wait a minute. I remember how this works. If you don't have the sub, you can't beat the level. I think you have to do that. And then, let's shoot this one. Which I think pops off those ones. Wait a minute. Nuts. No way. Did I seriously mess that up? Wait, no I didn't. Never mind. Oh, no way, I did too. Oh man, I'll have to come back and get this gem. I knew I was going to mess up somewhere. And this is the ending of level 2. <laughs> Typical. I'm dumb. And I think if we die, we don't get this, so there's no point in going back. Wait. Can't. What the heck? What that other mine? Why was it invincible? Okay, let's get a couple of these. Hey, Chompo, what's up? Is, a, is that a mine up there? Oh, yeah, never mind. I should say one box missed if we did everything correctly. Oh, never mind, I missed two back anyway. Anyways, let's leave. Well, first level that I'll have to go back and backtrack. I'll probably just do that on my own time. Not with you guys, because you guys don't want to see me going through an entire water level over. I don't even want to go through the entire water level over. I'll probably do that, like, at the end of the game. Anyways, two levels beaten and a boss. I think it's pretty much pretty a pretty good video. Maybe in the next video we'll actually get these two done. Plus, you know... That looks like... Oh no, that's a Coco level, never mind. So we got another flying level and just a basic level. So, stay tuned for more.